Even the best filament can cause print failures if it absorbs moisture. Popping sounds, stringing, rough surface. All these are signs of wet filament. In this video, we'll figure out how to dry filament properly and keep it ready for perfect prints. Most 3D printing plastics are hygroscopic. They absorb water from the air. Even a few days in an open spool can make the material unstable. When heated in the nozzle, this moisture turns into steam, creating bubbles in weak layers. The result, bad surface finish, poor adhesion, and fragile prints. Signs of moist filament. Crackling or popping while printing. Rough or matte surface instead of smooth. Stringing and blobs. Brittle filament that breaks easily when bent. If you notice any of these, time to dry your spool. How to dry filament. Filament dryer box, the most convenient and safe method. It maintains the right temperature and can even feed filament directly to the printer. Oven, set to 40 to 60 degrees Celsius depending on material. PLA 40 degrees Celsius, PETG 55 degrees Celsius, ABS 60 degrees Celsius. Leave the filament inside for four to six hours. Important, use a thermometer to avoid overheating or deformation. Food dehydrator, a cheap and effective alternative for small spools. Once dried, don't leave the filament open again. Store it in sealed boxes or bags with silica gel packs. You can also use vacuum bags with valves. Quick tips, always check ambient humidity. Below 40% is ideal. Dry filament every few months, even if it looks fine. Label each spool with the last drying date. Properly dried filament means stronger, cleaner, and more reliable prints. Take a few hours to dry and save days of failed printing. Don't forget to subscribe for more 3D printing tips and tests.